So these are the last of the packages that I haven't opened. All the previous ones came on different days, so I did have to open them just to make sure they weren't broken or anything. So this is the last batch. I guess I'll start with the big one first just to get it out of the way because it's taking up quite a lot of space. Also, look at how cute my cutter is. Can you guess what this is? It's a side table. It looks pretty easy to build, so I'm not too worried. Let's open this up. Ta -da! I have a lot of like random miscellaneous things that don't belong anywhere and neither are they aesthetic so I have to hide them in a bin so I bought bins with lids to hide the mess because no one needs to see that and I bought two sizes so there's the small one and also the big one I'm planning on stacking them up like this and the very last package this item in particular is a very basic thing pretty sure like all the girlies with a room tour has one but I just I couldn't help myself. I did try to refrain myself, but it was just not happening. Ta da! Please, please, please don't break. Oh, it's still bubble wrapped. <laughs> ah! It's fine. It's so cute. <laughs> and now it's time to actually get moving. Okay, so we are on to the last area in my room that I need to do. To be honest, I always thought that this corner is a little bit awkward because of the placement. Like, I never know what to do with it. But this time, we are going to embrace it. I'm going to attempt to make this into a little cozy nook 
I guess you could say. First of all, we're going to put up some wall decor. I already printed out a few things. This calendar I got from Pinterest and this one I actually took myself in Melbourne. And if you can't already tell, I really like Sumiko Garashi, especially Shirokuma, which is the polar bear. It's so cute! using a clothing pin to hold up my nail because I don't want to accidentally hammer myself. I have hit myself with a hammer a few times. Those times I didn't use a clothing pin but now I am so I should be safer. I've also marked where I want to put it because X marks the spot. <laughs> I'm actually really scared. Let me just channel my inner Bob the Builder. Okay. Oh no, it's not straight. Is that enough? Is that enough? Can you see my face right now? I literally worked up a sweat just doing that. <laughs> Should I try putting up the mirror? Okay. It's hanging. I've encountered a slight issue with the nail sticking out this much. It's making the mirror face down when I hang it, which I don't love. So I need something to hold it up like this, even though there's gonna be like a lot of space at the back. It took me a while to figure out how to fix this problem, but I have a solution. Tape, I know, but not in the way you're thinking, no. I'm literally gonna just put it here, right? And, ta-da! Modern problems require modern solutions. I may be no Bob the Builder, but I think you can call me Jimmy Neutron because this is big brain energy right here. Using 100% of my brain. 